After several months of Joe and Erin both working there, being within arm's reach of each other, their paths had almost never crossed. To be fair, Joe was working full time, Erin part time, but they were completely unaware of each other. Until that is the Christmas night out at the Marriott Hotel. <laughs> Finally, not only did they meet and start talking, but there was an immediate connection. And dancing to the fairy tale of New York, they shared their first kiss. Within the week, Erin and Joe were on their first date at the Christmas markets in George Square and then the cinema, off to Brayhead and then spending more and more time together. Joe becoming more and more convinced that he and Erin would be married. Erin going out with her first proper boyfriend was taking her time. And as their friendship became love, Erin and Joe began to talk about becoming engaged. Shona and David had suggested that they design an engagement ring together, incorporating a very special pair of earrings. And so as plans for the design of the ring came together, plans for the proposal were also underway. And so a conspiracy with Shona and David was required. So early one morning, we have Joe looking fab, dressed in his three-piece suit with a ring, a dozen red roses and a speech all prepared. Shona and David let him in the back door so that the dogs wouldn't bark and Joe sneaks in and up the stairs to Erin's bedroom. Where it would be fair to say Erin was not looking quite so fabulous. <laughs> there she was the morning after a late night of Irish dancing in Newcastle, still in her jammies, last night's makeup still on but not looking quite so good, hair all over the place and surprise! Maybe Joe got just as much of a shock seeing his future wife looking a bit dishevelled. But as Erin said, if he still wanted to marry her when she was looking like that, it must be love. Pancakes for Sunday breakfast and the rest as they say, it's history. I had a dream you left Woke up in the cold, cold sweat Sat up in the bed too quick I was spinning Moonlight on your cheek I listened to
Until the day